अच्छा शहरूज एक एक क्वेश्चन का आंसर आपने देना है फिर मैं एक कॉल भी सुनाना चाहूंगी लिसनर्स को तो आप बात कर रहे थे इमाम हुसैन की करनी थी जी मुझे बस यही कहना था कि अबाउट ऑपरेशन एंड ऑपरेशन जी 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 कि रसूल खुदा सल्लल्लाहु अलैहि वाले वसल्लम ने ये फरमाया है कि जब ऑपरेशन आपको नजर आए व्हेन यू सी जुल्म व्हेन यू सी पीपल आर सफरिंग यू नीड टू हेल्प नॉट ओनली दोस हु आर सफरिंग बट द वन हु इज क्रिएटिंग द ऑपरेशन एंड व्हेन ही वाज आस्क्ड व्हाट डज दैट मीन ही सेड यू हैव टू एजुकेट द वन हु इज हु इज ऑपरेसिंग सो दैट ही स्टॉप्स हिदायत देना भी एक uh it's in activism it's helping and this is what we do when we give awareness to the world about uh problems that are happening out there so that we create awareness and those who are inadvertently being a part of the crime step back and say i don't want to do this anymore inshallah is tarah ke programs aap rakh rahe hain ha isse bahut help hogi kyunki jo misunderstandings hain shia ke bare mein aur jo samajhte hain ki hum shirk kar rahe hain bidat kar rahe hain um unko bas thoda samajh le to shayad inshallah ye nafrat chali jaye और इन इमाम के लिए मोहब्बत आ जाए और उसकी वजह से फिर सब कुछ समझ आ जाएगा राइट नाउ वी आर कमेमोरेटिंग द डेज ऑफ द वुमेन ऑफ करबला एंड दे अमेजिंग वुमेन आई मीन टू हैव द हार्ट टू गिव अवे योर सन्स इन अ बैटल and and knowing that it's a losing battle quote Jeez. unquote losing Jeez. but then these are the women who understood that winning is not only when you have survived winning is when a message has survived and uh, you know the the uh, the oppression that we need to all stand up against fourth imam fourth imam is jo us waqt ek imam baki rahe zinda aur unke bete bhi the fifth imam um, imam mutaki was unhone ek bahut khoobsurat dua kaha hai allah subhanahu wa taala se kaha hai main un dua us gunah se panha mangta hu jiski wajah se bala aati hai kaun sa gunah wo ke jab koi zulm me ho aur main uski madad na karu so this happens to a person who has suffered mm. when you have suffered you realize you say i do not want to see anybody suffer and right now the women we commemorating the women of karbala after imam hussein was uh, martyred these women were put in chains mm. they were paraded the uh, 600 miles they had to walk and they were put on camels which were which were going very fast so these women were falling the children were tied with the women so that everyone's necks were being pulled and the fourth imam was put in chains and he had all sorts of uh, uh, torture being uh, put on these people but what did they do despite that they still gave hidayat to the people who were torturing them yeah imam imam sent to the forge of yazid ke dekho aap is kaam mein na lo hissa lekin wo they were deep and then they were put in a dungeon and yeah. uh, the daughter of imam hussein alayhi salam uh, passed away uh, she was martyred because all the atrocities but you know what's amazing mm-hmm. is uh, that we understand now when mom said alayhi salam took the women and children with him right. first of all it wasn't a suicide mission that's why cuz who takes the women and children if they're exactly. gonna... the second thing is that he knew that uh, they would be able to very confidently tell the world what had happened huh. he had believed in the they said it was an inkalab in his yeah, yeah, yeah. ye wo khandan hai jo sabko sabar sikhate the it doesn't mean they were not doing sabar who cannot do sabar if they mm. suffered and survived right, right? but they they are they are crying and their uh, lamenting was so that people would take notice and 1400 years ago people are still, still taking, notice, taking notice thanks to the message of bibi zainab alayhi salam who so um, much, who did tabligh under such difficult thank conditions thank you so much shairoz mujhe ek call sunani samne wo jura quote ask experts ki team